Today I'll show you how you can make pipes that explode when you shoot at them. Like this. How cool is that? The first thing is you're gonna add particle systems on the areas that you want the explosion to take place. And you're gonna search for types of water. Here you can find many of those. For example this one, this one. These particle systems have a feature that they only play once. They're not cyclic, so you need to re-trigger them with a particular event. I'm gonna create a brush with a texture invisible, so of course it's not visible. I'm gonna press Ctrl T to transform it into a trigger and then press Alt Enter and make it a funk button. But instead of being Use Activates, I want it to be Damage Activates. Give the bottom a name and do the same thing with your particle system. So in your bottom, you're gonna select On Damage, you're gonna target that entity, that particle, via this input Start. And you need to stop this particle system so it can be restarted. As long as the particle system is running, that is, is not being stopped, it will not be possible to trigger it again. So I want this particle system to be stopped at two seconds. This time, this number should be the same that you give your bottom delay before reset. If your bottom has a delay before reset of two, for example, and the particle system is stopped after 10 seconds, you can shoot at the bottom, but it's not gonna be triggered because you haven't yet stopped the particle system. That is why it's important that you stop it at the same time that you want the bottom to be re-triggered. And that's all there is to it. Have a very wonderful rest of your day.